Third. Third phase of Moon Blake Cousins going over videos just submitted to our Facebook and from around the world. Let's get to it. Let's get to Jack. Jack's back. And uh, we're going over an incredible video. Let me pull this up. Let's pull it up right now. And Jack is filming this from his ranch. Just today, we haven't spoken with him for almost about six months ago. And he's making contact again. We've been waiting for Jack to come back right here on Third Phase Moon with brand new, incredible, broad daylight video. It's captured during a rainstorm. As uh, Jack's, we're trying to get Jack on. Jack's here with us. There's a little problem with the lines right now, but we're going over the video right now. I want to get Brent on this real quick of what he's thinking. Blake, this is quite amazing. What I like about it, he just keeps shooting and he, re he remains calm in the cab. Keeps a pretty steady hand on what we're looking at here. And it's stunning. Blake, we're looking at this real time and I'm liking. And I hope everybody out there likes what they're seeing right now. Well, what I'm looking at right now is unde undeniably, it's not a drone. It's not any kind of aircraft. Look at, look at right there, it strings off. Some kind of flare, a transjector beam. That's weird. Yes, hello. Hey Jack, welcome back to Third Phase of Moon. It's been a long time. What's going on with this video? This is uh, quite insane. Well, I, I absolutely had to share this one with you folks out there because uh, this is, once again, I have no doubt in my mind that there are activities going on near where I live that I cannot explain. And this this beam of light that I saw in the sky, uh, it, it, it nearly made me have a heart attack when I was out there missing in the fences. And uh, it was raining real heavy out there. And uh, suddenly I started to see this beam of light shining through. So I stopped the truck and I, I get my camera out. I, was, I had my camera with me, thank God. And uh, I started filming for a couple of minutes and I was waiting for the rain to stop. And, and when the rain stopped, I started to get out of my truck. But it was so funny that uh, as soon as I thought, I had the thought, boy, I wish this rain would stop so I could get some, some better footage. That's when the rain stopped. I don't know if it was a coincidence or whatever, but I had the strangest feeling when I got out of that truck. A feeling of uh, almost calmness. Like I, you would think I would have been scared from the size of this light, but having seen some strange things there before, and, and even last time, I was somewhat scared at first, but then I did also have another strange feeling of calm. And I, that is another thing that I just really cannot explain. Well, Jack, uh, I'm looking at the video. We're Obviously, it's not a drone. Did you hear anything? It seems quite unnatural. Nothing like I can recognize of anything that's basically conventional. There really was no sound to be heard from this, this beam of light that, that uh, you can clearly see in the video. Uh, I really did not hear any sound whatsoever. I, I did go and uh i ran to the bushes quite frankly i uh i'm looking I was at that video startled and i did run into the bushes yes. away from the vehicle yep. I, I wasn't sure if it was a military exercise or whatever i just didn't want to get caught up in harm's way in any sense and i did run into the bushes and i stayed there for some time Why? concealing myself and uh continuing to film were you this, hiding this strange occurrence? Were you afraid? Were you afraid of what was going down? I I don't I didn't feel afraid, but I I I did feel compelled to get away from the vehicle. I really don't know why. I went into the bushes and I continued to film, but I just didn't want to be standing right there next to the vehicle, especially later when the uh when the helicopters all started coming in, going towards the light. Jack, I'm seeing that. That's quite incredible. What are, what are we looking at? 
opposite directions helicopters coming in from each side of this anomaly is was this military well i think that the helicopters were certainly military but the uh the lightning the, the beams of light i don't know what that was myself uh i think that the military had the thing surrounded me probably because they didn't know what it was either. It didn't seem like anything from this planet, anything I had ever seen before. Well, I've seen it disappear. It just blinks out, like out of, out of. Well, as the helicopters approached it from all sides, after about a minute or so, the whole thing just, just, imploded like it all shrunk into nothingness it just it 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 slowly disappeared over the course of about a maybe 25 30 seconds it was gone jack's kind of breaking up there jack uh wow jack you still there he's kind of breaking down yeah, yeah i'm what? still here okay jack you got to get back to us. How long did this video last? So far, we're about into four minutes of this. Almost rock cut. How long did you shoot this? Well, after I ran into the bushes, I would say I had it going for about three or four minutes. And then uh, my camera battery must have just died out on me or something because uh, that, that was all I got. Well, what you got was quite amazing. Jack has been submitting videos. Well, two so far within the past year. And I'm glad Jack's back again, like I said. Wow, this is uh, some of the best stuff I've seen this year. Early this year, 2016. Broad daylight sightings, night sightings. And I can't explain what this is. Everybody, uh, stand by. We, we got a roll. On the roll right now is what it's all about because people have their eyes on the skies like Jack does. And sometimes you gotta be in the right place at the right time. Jack, thanks for sharing this. We're gonna be sharing more videos tomorrow. Uh, can you join us for more insight? Well, it was my pleasure to be on the show once again, and I promise I will certainly share any footage I managed to capture I think there's definitely something real strange going on in my neck of the woods. And you most certainly be for me. Wow. Uh, it's Jack's breaking up. Jack's breaking up. But that's that's the way it is. Real-time video. Real-time uh, interviews. Everybody, keep your eyes on the skies. We're not alone. Blake Cousins, we're standing by. Keep your eyes on the skies, everybody.
Unidentified. Unidentified. Flying. Object.